Hey players, welcome back for another video. Today I'll be going over Splinter Cell Remake and everything that we know on it so far. Now players, I heard that Splinter Cell was really good. I never played it, but once I heard that they were make, remaking it, I got really excited because I knew that these games were bangers and I really wanted to play it. So to hear that it's being remade, that, that means the world to me. But let's just dive right into it. It feels like the Splinter Cell Remake has been on its way for a decent while now, which isn't helped by the fact that it's been over two years since we heard anything official about the game. From what we've seen so far, the team behind the remake appears to be aiming to rebuild the stealth game for an all new audience without straying too far from the source material. Despite this evident lack of updates, it's still easy to see why the Splinter Cell Remake is one of the most anticipated upcoming games on the horizon. Given just how groundbreaking the original game was when it released in 2002, arguably it paved the way for the third person stealth games that followed and I expect the remake to offer up this classic experience but retooled for a more modern experience. Ubisoft released a video announcing the Splinter Cell remake in December 2021. In addition to the announcement, the video also delves into the history of the Splinter Cell series and how it changed the identity of Ubisoft taking the Toronto-based studio from working on Rayman, a bright and colorful platformer, and thrusting it into the AAA lifestyle. Ubisoft hasn't released any more Splinter Cell Remake trailers as of yet, but you can still find more deep dives into the classic stealth series on Ubisoft's official YouTube channel. We know that Splinter Cell Remake will revisit the world and story from the first game released in 2002. The original plot starts with two undercover US operatives that go missing in Georgia, leading to Black Ops agent Sam Fisher being sent to investigate. As Sam searches for the missing agents, he uncovers a larger plot surrounding a corrupt government and nuclear missiles. It's unclear how much of this plot will remain in the Splinter Cell remake. However, as Ubisoft confirmed in a now deleted job listing from September 2022 via Tech4 Gamers, that it is rewriting and updating the story for a modern day audience. The listing stated, we want to keep the spirit and themes of the original game while exploring our characters and the world, to make them more authentic and believable. So while producer Matt West has previously established Ubisoft wants to ensure the spirit of their early games remains intact, expect a few updates. In the announcement blog post, producer Matt West revealed that the Splinter Cell remake is being built from the ground up, so players can expect visual and design updates. West also confirmed, contrary to a rumor, the remake will be linear and not feature an open world. Further details haven't been shared on Splinter Cell Remake's gameplay. However, as this is a remake of the original title, we can expect that the hallmarks that made Splinter Cell so iconic will be present here. Stealth was always the operative goal in the series, using the environment around you. The lighting and flexible movement was preferable rather than brute force forcing your way through obstacles. The Splinter Cell Remake is being built on Ubisoft's Snowdrop engine. Ubisoft has confirmed the Splinter Cell Remake is being developed on its Snowdrop engine, which is also being used for its upcoming Star Wars game and was used for Avatar Frontiers of Pandora. So players, that was everything we know on the Splinter Cell Remake so far. Now players, let me know all of your thoughts on this remake. What do you guys think about it? What, what are you most looking forward to? What do you want, if you played the old Splinter Cell game, what would you want to see hop over from that game over this game or get sent over? Because I heard that that game is really amazing and I cannot wait for them to give us more info because I'm definitely going to play this remake when it drops, that's for sure. But what about you guys? Now guys, this guy right here, he was a Splinter Cell veteran, like he absolutely loved the game. But what do you think, sir? What do you think should happen with the Splinter Cell franchise? Do you think it should get remade? What would you want to see in this game? Well, yeah, definitely. I will definitely would love a new Splinter Cell game. We, we we Splinter Cell fans have been waiting for this franchise to come back. I mean, what 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 other game will be better than that? One hundred percent, guys. You heard it from him, and he's a Splinter Cell god, guys. Like you don't understand. He used to be on that Splinter Cell game when he heard that about that news. That I told him the video I was gonna do on, he's like, oh, no way, I gotta get that game as soon as it drops. Let me know. And I said, well, that's what Ken's Gaming Tech Channel is here for, guys. So please make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel for no more news and updates just like this one. And I'll see you guys all in the next video. Peace out.